Uh, hi everyone. So here we are scrapping the the bookstore website, and this is the fourth video. So we were able to actually uh, contain all the different URLs of uh, this page. So here you can see in poetry we were having all these different books, and we were able to get the URLs. Now next thing is after getting these links, we will iterate on each and every link, and we will extract the data from each and every page. So for that extract data we got all the links we are running for of loop and we have created this we are actually going to each and every link getting the content we are waiting until this page contains content in our dom node so here like uh, content in our we are waiting so when you go to this page we are waiting for this particular tag there is just any tag which must be there on the page okay after that we are getting the content you can get the content later after you wait for it and page content you can pass to extract page data method here you got the the page html of that new page and here we will try to extract the image the name and description so let's do this so here we can see we can see this product page this is unique so we can actually loop on to the product page so it's a cheer io right okay so here we are getting each and every element so we can actually go through this element and here we can write our next method okay after getting the product page we need to get the the image link right so what the image link contains is image take and this is inside a thumbnail class so what we can do is dot find i'm trying to find thumbnail class inside that i can do find an image tag right so it's like we are getting image and I can get the URL of that image using image dot attribute and here I will pass src okay this is how I will get the image let's move to uh, this title so this title is available inside product main it's uh, still inside product page so there is a product main tag we can use this and there is a h1 tag paragraph tag so it should be simpler we can reuse this code so here we need to inspect this product main page here we have h1 tag and we just need to get the text title dot text and this will become our title we are doing a product main is a class this one is a tag and type text right similarly we can do the same thing for the description so if you go to the description or you can say price price we can get from the first we can actually do the class name directly for this class name dot text right inside the product main you can find this particular class directly and you can get the text it is about price we got image we got title we got price we can also get the description so description is coming inside this yes there is an id description and we need to get okay for the description we have to go here this is a paragraph tag inside product page okay is there any class associated with this i don't see a class so what we can do is if you try to do a find by paragraph we should be able to get it product page uh let's try to let us let's give it a try here we are trying to do a find with p and then we are doing dot text this should give us a description and now just run it so we are scrapping each and every page and trying to print this okay and start we may see some errors but that should be fine you should be able to debug it okay things are good i think we are getting everything we need we can actually trim this data 
if we are getting the ESC then just to avoid the undefined issues here also we can trim this we can make it way better for now we are just removing the spaces unnecessary spaces so this is how we are getting our content and we are able to scrap it okay so we are getting image title price description now we can actually format it in the json object and can return it right so this is how we can actually make it better look wise so here we are getting links we might be missing we are not missing any data i think uh, if i scroll it up and down we are getting all the data it just we just need to do a little bit formatting okay so what i will do is i will return an object from here for each and every link uh, you can say book data that is an object and i will add all these things to that fine and i can finally return from all these things i can return book data and once i return book data there can be a master array where i will doing a book dot post payload okay this is how i'm able to scrap it it's just an example i was trying to show you how you can scrap it even puppeteer allows you to do a click actions like uh, you can actually click on to these individual links and you can scrap each and every page okay so that we will talk in another example i hope this is this might be now clear how we are using puppeteer and cri together cri is inspecting dom and giving us the data what we need puppeteer is launching the different pages after launching the browser you can actually so here we launch the home page then we are using the same object same page object to go to each and every url and we are using async await so we are doing a sequential in a for of loop going to each and every page and scrapping the content and getting it and then going to the another piece okay this is all uh, thanks everyone